Hey, Derek, we're chasing a sun. It's another beautiful day here in Vancouver in our autumn months. So I'm taking full advantage of it. That's why I'm heading up to Squamish with some friends to check out the back roads in this DR650. Now, let's see what these roads are all about. Good morning. Okay, so those are the sights that you'll get to see as you ride up the very scenic Sea to Sky Highway from Vancouver to Squamish. The place to get off here is at the Brackendale exit and you'll get, to, it's basically where the Alice Lake is. It's uh, just after Brackendale and then turn left on Squamish Valley Road. Squamish Valley Road will eventually branch out into Fork. This goes to Paradise Valley Road and then on this side is where you wanna stay on to the left and that gets you to continue on Squamish Valley Road. This road will take you right through following the river up to this area here where pavement will run short and then it'll be the forest road opening up after that. So this is what you get to look forward to if you make the trek out to Squamish. Check out the Squamish Valley Road and the Paradise Valley Road. At the end of it, it turns into gravel and there's lots of little places that you can go explore. Now really, this whole area here north of Squamish is chock full of dirt roads, mostly logging and forestry roads. If you were just starting to explore this area, then you could just take any dirt road off the highway here and then each one will branch into many more to explore. Most of the roads are fairly easy as long as you have at least an adventure bike with decent tires, you'll be fine. I rode up on a DR650 with two buddies who were on a KTM 790 Adventure and a BMW 1250GS. A good resource for you if you're looking for trail maps is the Forestry Service Road Safety Information Site and that's at governmentofbc.maps.arcgis.com. Here you'll see which roads are closed and have warnings on them, but then look at all of these great routes here. That's the nice thing about it, all of the forestry roads will be highlighted here so that you know. And if we go to where we're at here, this is basically where Squamish Valley will take you up following this river. And after that, you've got forestry roads. And this whole area just continues on and on and on. So there's lots of roads all out here. This is a long one here that you can just go and explore to your heart's content. Now, I'm also just still exploring this area myself. So if you're watching this and you've been up here lots of times and have found some really nice trails, then post up in the comments so that we can share with the audience. So we took the Squamish River Forestry Road and uh, we are treated with this broken bridge but check out the view here. People swimming in the river, it's all good fun. And look at this side. This is why I love forestry roads and just exploring in the dirt because you don't get this kind of stuff on the paved roads.
All right, we had a lot of fun exploring the back roads of Squamish, along the roads of Squamish Valley and Paradise Valley. And now we're just taking a break at one of our favorite lunch spots, the Watershed. Uh, if you haven't been here before, definitely check it out. You're right on the river. It's gorgeous. And if you come around October and onwards in the autumn, you actually get to see eagles. Uh, it's a great eagle watching site. So yeah, I hope you like this video. And if you do explore the back roads, leave a comment. Let me know how it goes for you. Mm -hmm.